when you're 15, 16 years old. Yeah. I think for the worst thing that I've seen is when you see girls that are 13, 14 that start modeling. And then, you know, they hit puberty. And then everyone's like, oh my god, did you hear what happened to this girl? She did gained so hips, much like, weight. Did you see her hips? Well, of course, that's the best one. I'm like, yeah, she blew up. I'm like, she's 15 or 16 now? Yeah. It's gonna happen. Like, yeah. she is gonna hit puberty. Yeah, I've like, I've heard but People seem to forget, and... like, oh, puberty. Heard like, bookers and photographers talk about, like, the like will she won't she period of like 16 to 18 will she get hips will she not get hips and actually yeah, talking about it like her. exactly and I'm oh, like, even in front of the girl and she's like sitting there like what <laughs> like just completely clueless yeah oh it's so like it's amazing how like people forget that models are people and especially in these young girls right you have like such young ones that are like starting out so mm -hmm. early yeah and like is it like, I don't know, I question that. Like, is it smart to start them so early when you know that there's going to be this maybe period? Like, do you want to just, like, suck what you can out of them until the maybe? Yeah, like, exactly. And then what? It's right? kind of weird. Yeah, I think for me, it's... I don't know, if girls ever want to start modeling, they need to have a solid head on their shoulders. They need to have their parents support them and be by them. Mm -hmm. And if they're younger than, like, if they're younger than 16 years old, I think the parents should always be there especially at shoots and to help them like with their career and to go talk to these agents and I think as soon as there is that you know maybe period or you know they're discussing weight I think the parents should take a stand like no you know what she's gonna she's gonna stop for a bit and then maybe she can start again when she's 18 if she you know is still in her measurements or whatever yeah I'm trying to get up before was that I think that the industry should kind of take a take like a little bit of a shift here a little bit of a change and start to accept girls that are in their 20s mm -hmm. Because what's happening is like you have like the sexualization of these very, very young girls that are younger than 18 years old. That's not even legal. Mm -hmm. Like you heard what happened in China. There were two girls. I think it was two girls that were in China Vogue. They were younger than 16. They were 15 mm -hmm. years old. You know, Vogue China right admitted after, to yeah. it. Yeah. Right after, you know, Vogue said we're not going to use the models under 16 years old. Mm -hmm. Surprise, surprise. Oops. Here we go, two 15 year olds. Oops, yeah. we didn't know. Come on, bullshit, you mm -hmm. know. Or at least you could have asked the agency, how old are these girls? Mm -hmm. But I think what's ha what bothers me is you're know, having the sexualization of these extremely young girls. Mm -hmm. And then, this might be a little bit off topic, but what's happening is, you know, they're in these magazines and they're wearing, you know, sultry dresses, they have sultry wedding makeup, gowns. wedding gowns, you know, these girls are looking, you know, double their age. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, you have pedophiles coming in, looking at these girls and this, like, ogling these young girls. And that, but like, that's the problem is that, you know, we're like almost saying that this is okay. You know, we're putting these young girls out there. Meanwhile, you have like these men that are like looking at these girls and it's just like, we need to stop. Like, do you mean just like, out, like just in like general society or do you mean at, like in the industry? Like in the industry. Like photographers and stuff? Or well, in that respect, no photographers as well. And then I think as a whole, like in society as well. I think as you have like these like, young girls that are being so sexualized like in these magazines mm -hmm. and you know in these sultry poses as well you know they're being asked to pose and they're like inappropriately then you have like you know men like looking at these girls like you know girls that are 16 are doing bikini shoots and then you have men like looking at these girls mm -hmm. right? whether or not they know how whether old or not are. they know how old they are yeah. and then they're just you know they're getting like turned on by these girls mm -hmm. like that's horrible like why are we using 16 year old girls for this why can't we use the 22 year old girls where it's legal where it's mm -hmm. okay exactly so i've always had such an issue with that it's always been and it's really bothering me. Yeah, like, I think rightly. And, like, you take those, like, girls and you put them into the real world and this is what, you know, this is what you may to look like at a shoot. You assume this is what looks good and this is what I'm supposed to do in real life, too. Yeah, exactly. This is supposed to somehow transfer over. Yeah. No information. No.